Shanahan Militaria. Today's video was voted on the live stream. Um, if for those of you that don't know, we do a live stream here at Shanahan Militaria every Friday night at eight o'clock Irish time. So if you're around and you want to pop in, you're more than welcome to pop in. So we did a vote. Um, I got items in and we did an unboxing, live unboxing, and I asked the audience at the time what they would like to see, and there was two. So the two items that were uh, voted on was a windproof smock and this item. Now this is a public order riot baton. Now I'm not sure if it's collectorism or, uh, or, or I've, ne I've never actually seen official documentation for it but this one is known as the Mark II whereas this one is the Mark I. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put them on the table, or sorry, the chair, and we're just going to have a quick look at them, quick look at measurements and stuff, and diameters and things like that, and I will show you how to tell the two, the two of them apart. So now we have the battens here on the chair, we're just going to have a quick look at them. Uh, so this is the, shall we say, the Mark 1 version, and this is the Mark 2 version. Uh, this one is the older of the two. You see this being used first in Cyprus even, in, in different conflicts, Aden, um, and then you see this one popping up in Northern Ireland. Now, this seems to be an economy version, if you get me. There's less finishing in this one than there is in this one. This one is actually heavier than the Mark II. Uh, just straight away how you can tell the difference between the two is the older one, or the Mark I one, one, the bottom of it is rounded. And when you look at the Mark II version, it's flat. It's literally just been cut across the top. Um, and I'd say that was done for the likes of Remy carpenters or engineer carpenters or whatever in stores or in their workshops that they could literally tool these out as quick as possible and get them on the streets. Um, the other difference is the back of them. If you see here on the back of this one. Now this one originally had a leather strap like this but um, over time it's gotten lost and somebody has replaced it with paracord. But you can see this ball, it's a lot more rounder at the bottom than the second pattern. And the first one is a lot heavier than the second one there. The Mark II version and the finger grooves are a lot deeper and a lot more defined compared to the Mark II version. Now, there is a difference in the measurements as well. So I'll just put them there a second and I will get my measuring tape. Yeah, well, I, you don't need the measuring tape yet for a minute, but if I bought them end to end, you can see there is a good two inches inch and a half maybe in the uh, difference of uh, length of the two of them. Um, the Mark 1 shall we say just roughly is 25 and a half inches and the Mark 2 is exactly two foot so 24 inches so there's an inch in the an inch and, inch and a bit in the difference. Now I don't believe as much of a difference in the circumference at the top but we'll just give it a quick check um, roughly can't roughly tell I'd need a proper measuring tape but I wouldn't say there's not, not there's not much of a difference really in the circumference at the top and now you do see these ones and both of them actually where they have been drilled here at the top and they've been filled with lead or sand or something and recorked just to make them that bit heavier the Mark 1 is actually a lot heavier than this version. Um, so yeah, so that's just a quick comparison video of the two different riot, public order riot battens that you will find in the north. There is a different variant that you do come across. I have ha have heard it being referred to as the Mark 3, but there's a rope handle on it, or there's like a, a, a bound handle on it. Um, and supposedly they were RUC ones. I'm not 100% sure. I know the RUC had a, a complete rubber variant as well. But military wise, these are, these are the two military ones that you will come across. So there you go, just a quick video on the public order riot battens that were used in Northern Ireland. 
Um, if you do like what we provide here at Shanahan Military and you do like the content, please subscribe, please hit the notification button, the little bell button, so you will be notified of upcoming videos. If you want to get in contact with the channel, the email for the, to get in contact with the channel will always be on top of the video description. So, thank you and I hope to see you again. Thank you.